Hi Russ. Hi Al. How are we doing? Uh, not too bad. Good. Now it's uh, it's been a fun day. We're down at the chamber, Clack Eaton. Don't cheat tight. Uh, you've just done a entertaining the uh, vocals, um, doing your unique style of alternative songs, if you like, alternative versions of songs. Uh, yourself and your daughter Daisy. So this one's an old uh, jazz number, I suppose it's called. Five foot two. How tall are you? No, that's how old you are. <laughs> She's 110 centimetres. But that doesn't quite fit with the song. 110 centimetres? No, I don't. So. <laughs> classes at the Wickham Ukes, uh, which is held every Wednesday between 7 and 9. Uh, I also do my own sessions at the library on an alternative uh, Mondays, and that's half 10 till half 11. I played in bands, this is what I do. Yeah, I understand. Uh, kind of demonstrate that the ukulele is more than just like a toy, as most people call it. Yay! Like ties, don't you? Crazy dancing, come on, give it some.
family talking to you I she, she said that your father was a musician and um, how did it come about you say this little double act you do which I know a lot spontaneous and a lot of your work is spontaneous but you bounce off each other how did this come about when did you notice it or how did you notice it well what it is it I went to see one of my musical heroes on the ukulele a guy called James Hill who's from Canada over in USA and uh, I got speaking to him after he finished the concert and I explained to him that uh, my partner was pregnant and that I wanted to so like maybe do something ukulele wise in my son or daughter's early life and he suggested that maybe just twinkle a couple of strings and stuff uh, during the early years which is what I did and straight away she immediately took to it and it's kind of grown from there she's very uh, adaptable she listens to stuff and takes it all in really so yeah she, she, but what everybody seems to love is the spontaneity I mean, you, you know, you bounce off each other, and that's great, that's great. And she, I mean, she's only young, how old is Daisy? Uh, she's four. Four, and you can see the musical talent coming out in the, I mean, a comic timing is unbelievable. Well, that's the thing, uh, a lot of people do actually think stuff are pre-planned, but everything you see is not pre-planned at all. Right. Uh, everything you see and everything you get is spur of the moment. What happens, happens, and uh, that's yeah. how it's always been, and it, it's always worked out for the best really like, rather than pre-planning it it works yeah. out better just in prop so the, the comic time you've got between you is absolutely brilliant now okay who's got a birthday coming up pretty soon anybody someone must have a birthday coming up soon someone's getting married soon so we we have a way up to you guys Oh, there's a guy over there, and your name is? Ian. Ian. Remember that? Ian Philippa was trying to squeeze it both in one. <laughs> so this is a song we do quite regularly on Facebook. It sits over someone's birthday. Uh, and it's a song... Daisy, who wrote this song? Daisy, who wrote this song? I did, yeah. It's called Happy Birthday. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Daisy's going to grow up, become a young woman. Yeah, that, that's um, the thing. That I, sorry, how, how, how are you going to? Are you going to move on from that, or are you going to? Have you got plans for the future? Ideally, yeah, I'd like I'd like to branch out on my own a little bit, but uh, Daisy seems to be the book that brings people. And I'm going to take advantage of that. I won't lie to you. And uh, while it's lasting, I'll, I'll Enjoy. keep on doing it. Enjoy, yeah. So how can I find you, Russ? I know you do the library, uh, you do tuition for the library. Tell, yeah. us, tell us a little bit about that. Uh, that's on alternative Monday mornings. Uh, if you have any queries, contact the library, they'll give you the details. Uh, what it is, is, it's open to anyone, regardless of your abilities. You can be a star, you can be an experienced player, and I like to kind of wreck it up. Uh, anyone's allowed to come. I bring spare yokes, it's free, and I guarantee you, you'll go away within one hour learning at least. Well, that, or that's maybe the Clackey Library. Clackey Library, yeah. just going to do one more. <laughs> yeah, we'll do one more. Let's, let's, 
do it by myself. Oh, no, <laughs> are you going to dance for us? It is it. And then now, where's your son? Stay with your son. Oh, okay, yeah. she's telling me. Yeah. <laughs> We've got a lot of ukuleles, haven't we? Yeah, but I just have two. Some that mummy don't even know about. I have three, I have three, but now I just have two. Oh. Just have two. M most guys yeah, go downstairs to do some else. Uh, yeah, they're like, because they're like, I'm going down to play the ukulele. This is like. Do you know what one of the is? And then they go off and people say, ah, more, more, more. And then they all come back on for more. Yeah? yeah. <laughs> that was the last one. Yeah, I said that. That wasn't really the last one. That's what people say. You've not been to a proper concert yet, have you? Uh, that last one. You went to see Andy and the Odd Socks, didn't you? That one. And they said it with the last song. Then they came on and did some more. <laughs> Do you remember that? Because that's put you on my shoulders and it really hurt my shoulders. Is it? I mean, it didn't matter because I couldn't. You were really heaven. I wasn't really bothered that you couldn't see because you were really heaven. You were sweating me. What? You were sweating me. What? I was sweating. Yeah, because I was all being Oh, yeah, I was sweating. You're heavy for a four year old. Well, it's all like chicken nuggets, isn't it? No, I don't like that. Okay, well, what, what song do you want to do? Maybe I like this one. Maybe that one. Alright, let's do one you want to do it on. So, let it go. Oh, you said it to them earlier. Let it go. Let it go. Uh, what's it called? It's a, just type in that on Facebook and you will find me there. That's great. Thank you for your time, Russell. It's been a great afternoon. There's been a great turnout. Everybody's going away with a big smile on their face, which Russell and Daisy always seem to create, which is what it's all about. Great part of the community is Russell. Um, good luck with the future and we'll see you soon, Russell. Goodbye, everybody. <laughs> That's great.